So this video might sound a bit elementary, but I think this is super important because I have had times in the past where I forget to have fun and enjoy my present moment. And about my atrocity of an upload schedule, a little part of me has actually been trying to have a little fun in the real world since I needed some time away. So this video is actually just a massive excuse for not uploading. That's a joke, but let's start from the beginning. This story starts on the 28th of January, where I'm visiting my good friend Symbol for a few days, just to have a few days out of my house. When I wake up to his mom telling me that his dad hit my car in the driveway. I was not worried at all. Didn't mind that it happened because it was barely a dent and just a few scratches. She further told me though, that she felt so bad about it that they filed an insurance claim. Although I appreciated the gesture, I felt bad about this because they really didn't have to. Again, it was barely anything, but now they'll be paying a couple hundred bucks in the form of a deductible, and my car will also be going in the body shop for potentially even a month, which kind of sucked until I found out that I was eligible for a rental car. Being in the US, there are specific age laws surrounding some economic actions that require liability. For example, you can't book a hotel until you're 18, you can't rent a car in my state of residence until you're 21, and an exotic car until you're 25. So being 19, I didn't think I would be allowed to have a rental from Simple's insurance, but I was. So my father and I ended up going to a car rental dealer and we were told that I would receive a quote, comparable car. Now, when I think of comparable, I think of a car that has similar mileage, similar specifications, similar age, and so on. Since I have a 2008 Pontiac, which I do really love my car, I thought I'd receive a similar car. But when they say comparable, they're talking about size and class. So they gave me an economic sedan, which is the same as what my current car is. But my word, did they give me something sweet? I got a 2019 Toyota Avalon x -Elite. That's a $30,000 car, used. So let's just say I had a little fun. I took my girlfriend out on a date, I offered to run errands for my mom, and I literally drove around town blasting to music for no flipping reason. This car was the definition of fun. And this little surprise came in clutch because I was really stressed about all I had to catch up on returning from a five day trip and also just making big life decisions that aren't the most exciting. This car was able to distract me enough to enjoy it and have fun for a time. I say all of this because sometimes we live in a workaholic society. You can turn anywhere just to hear and see work. Unfortunately, we never get a break from it, but there are times that I see myself failing to have fun, ultimately failing to live life. There's gonna be times that are stressful, unpredictable, exhausting, and even scary. But in those moments, remember to have even just a little fun because putting a smile on your face, even for just a few minutes, can make all the difference. Unfortunately though, I didn't really have that car for too long. It's only about two days, <laughs> but it was all I needed to get through the rest of the week. Thanks for watching, see you next time.